Yeah, um, they talked about the similarities uh, between the two countries, the things that the two countries have in common. Of course, the obvious one is uh, energy, petroleum and gas and, um, and how to cooperate uh, in that area and, uh, and also how to cooperate in other fields like uh, agriculture uh, in particular was, uh, was mentioned. And they also talked about um, um, the challenge to uh, multilateralism uh, in the world, you know, and the importance of strengthening multilateralism and that Iran and Nigeria both have an important role to play as big countries uh, with um, uh, rich human resources and, um, you know, and the wealth they have from um, natural resources, uh, how they can also push uh, for multilateralism uh, to be the order of the day and avoid you know, a, a unipolar world, you know. And um, they talked about uh, setting up, uh, strengthening a joint commission uh, between the two countries uh, to strengthen bilateral relations and um, for the joint commission uh, to be at the highest level uh, possible um, <clears throat> as a way forward, as leaders in the two different regions uh, that it was important for these two countries to, uh, to take the lead. And of course, Mr. President talked about the uh, recent elections in Nigeria and the fact that um, a new president will be taking over in, um, in less than three months. And, um, and, you know, hoping that the strong relations they built between the two countries will continue, will endure. And, um, and of course, the Iranians congratulated him on um, his stewardship and wished him well. Are there specific issues raised by the Iranian Vice President? What did he say informed the visit? Yes, uh, they wanted a greater cooperation. You know, Iran is under, um, you know, international sanctions and, um, you know, and really, you know, struggling, fighting with the West. Um, you know, not literally, but, um, you know, economically and all that because of the, you know, nuclear issues and all that. So, um, so I think for the Iranians, uh, this was an opportunity to, um, to engage with a very a big country, another big country, a big, another big influential country, um, to, to maintain the, the, the channels of communication and the cooperation so that um, Iran can um, you know, also break out of the isolation that, uh, that it, fights, that it finds itself in, at least with regards to Western countries. So how did the president respond? Uh, yes, of course. You know, the president talked about the fact that he had uh, been earlier uh, a minister of um, petroleum and, uh, and had, been able, had engaged with Iran uh, over many years and understands the country and understands the people and, um, and so welcomes the strengthening of relations uh, between the two countries as um, you know we have um, 